Jumelang, Jumelang, Bahaitu. I'm coming to you live with a new wig. Kirikila Wiki, what's your name? Kirikila Wiki, it arrived on Friday evening. So, Friday after work. So, a package by my door. I thought I was done with all the packages. As you guys saw in my previous video that I ordered from Kupang, a few household items. And everything arrived on Wednesday, so how can wanna end up Friday after we kire? so what is going on here? So backstory, I feel like this is always a backstory. I ordered this wig last month, eh, November eleventh. Ne? The arrival time was supposed to be uh, November twenty fifth. But guess when this girl arrived? November 9th. No, November 9th. December 9th. Because there was a mix-up with the address. I bought it on AliExpress. And the seller was so nice. Like, she was communicating throughout. Waiting. Like, I was stressed because it was my first time. I AliExpress. I've never shopped on AliExpress before. I mean, in South Africa, if you need hair, you can just go to Dragon City if you live in Joburg. So, that's what I would do. Nikki get a dragon city every time I needed hair. Like, I just never, like, trusted. <laughs> I just never felt comfortable to a point where I can trust that my orders would, would arrive from China to South Africa. I knew the girls were doing it. The girls and the guys were doing it. But I was not one of the girls who were doing it. Like, I did not want to be that case with stuff. And I, I think I had tried to order on AliExpress in 2016. When I first heard about it, I didn't have much information. I didn't know how to check reviews. I didn't know how to contact sellers. I didn't know, like, and that order just never came. So after that, so after that, I did it just to test. So it was a test, the makeup brush. And it was not that expensive. She nearly 60 rand that the makeup brush day five. So now I just want to straighten this wig right now because I wore it straight out of the box. I was so excited. I was so happy. I was like, I'm going to wear this straight out of the box. Friday night. Got home, tried on the wig, was doing some shenanigans on my Instagram. Saturday, I had to leave. Sunday, I'm back. So I didn't, I see Kilo, I want to go buy groceries. I want to go buy a pair of shoes. Like, I didn't think, anyways, when you have just that one pair of shoes, like I came to Korea so unprepared, like so unprepared. I don't even, I didn't, I didn't even bring one pair of winter shoes. So that's why I've had to now shop for shoes so immediately after my food comes i'm gonna eat i already took a shower i'm feeling so tired i should probably have a beer i also have some wine but the wine i'm gonna have later when i wine dine you know what i'm saying i got nuggets i got wings and a burger let's open my burger I'm sitting like on my mat on the floor. What did I order? Tabasco, what what? Ooh, it's gonna be so chilly. I like I'm so tired. Like I need to eat like I need to eat like now. I need to eat now. to I I have to go buy food. I mean, it's not like fridge I empty, empty, empty. Yeah, no, but if I don't do it today, when will I do it? A few moments later. So the last time you saw me, I was eating earlier on. Like I bigger thing. Can you imagine? But also, I don't blame myself. The lighting here isn't so great. I don't blame myself because I got chicken nuggets and then I got um chicken wings and I had those first. Um and then the burger. So but I'm awake. I'm going grocery shopping. I don't know if I'll go shoe shopping. Just, grocery shopping is just so therapeutic for me, especially when I'm not feeling my best. Oh, Eric, it's a big 
it's like five degrees outside it's not that cold drama when it comes to like dressing up i will be so hot i will be so hot so quickly where is my card okay let me put it back where it belongs so yeah i'm just gonna go grocery shopping right now and do the round Top mate, it's 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 closed. I should have felt it in my blood. Should have, cause I said maybe I should just go to downtown, get like a during the week. But I was like, no, no, no. So now I'm just going downtown straight. Kikela ABC mat. I think after all, what I need is retail therapy. Go ahead and clap. I need them anyway. Anyway, I just need a pair of shoes. Not just a pair, maybe two pairs, three pairs. I don't know. Ooh, ah, ah, two, two, two. Ooh, ah, ah. I really wanted this shoe. Oh my goodness, it's now even cheaper. <gasps> this shoe used to be 95,000. Got Black Friday. I guys. I don't want this one. I want this one. <sighs> Ooh, this is so nice. Oh my But then my friend convinced me. She's like, you should try it on first. Because you don't know how it's going to look on your leg. Don't I look cute? So I'm gonna buy this shoe instead of that other one because that one is 60,000 and I feel like I can buy two pairs of shoes with that price and 39,000. So I'm gonna buy this pair of shoes and then go look for a pair of boots so that I don't just have these shoes. Shoes that I wanted were sold out in my size. All of them. All of the shoes that I wanted. So now I'm just here uh, in the underground shopping center and I'm going to the shoe store because I saw a nice boot. Got ABC Martine, but it's 55,000 and I want to compare prices before I purchase anything. So I'm just here looking if it's higher or it's lesser if it's lesser i'm gonna buy it here if it's higher then i'm gonna go back to abc mart and get that one for myself so i saw one of my students come to school wearing one of these not like exactly these ones but they were white the ones that she was wearing was something like this and i have been on an unconscious search for them these earmuffs 
and I finally found them. They are 9,900 and I'm going to buy myself one. I'm just having to pick and choose which color I like. Like, are they fluffy? Which color? And do I want the ears? I thought I was gonna get these ones because they have the cinnamon roll character and my students love cinnamon roll so i'm gonna get them i'm busy buying a lot of miscellaneous items like the like the fact that top mat was closed um i couldn't find shoes in my size so now i'm just walking around actually i'm going to the store the next door that i got my boots from and i'm trying to see if they have my size oh here it is here i think it's this one I think it's this one. To Daiso for gloves. Now I'm by the nail section. Press ons, nail polish, nail polish remover. Oh my goodness. Eric, you look at love before I start splurging on other stuff because I started seeing skincare as well. Tell you guys, I came to Daiso for literally gloves. Lim messy. But I'm out here at the glass section looking for wine glasses because. I have a bottle of wine in my fridge and I haven't had wine a lot ever since I came to Korea. I've been drinking a lot of beer. So, and the wine glass that I have that I got with the apartment is not so cute. So I want a cute wine glass. Plus, when Violet comes over, Violet has a lot of like very cute wine glasses. So she's going to come over during the winter vacation. coffee. <laughs> Oh, because I only have like one wine glass and it's not even cute. So I need to get like at least two wine glasses or three. Because Caesar doesn't drink. So I'm just going to get two for myself and Violet when she comes over. Because she is going to come over. I also got some skincare. I'm still shopping. Just got done at Daiso. And as always, I spend money that I did not need to spend which sucks so comment down below if you can go to Daiso and spend less than 50,000 I just want to see you I want to know your name I want to know how so you can teach me because there's no way every time I'm like okay I'm just gonna spend 40,000 20,000 5,000 it's always like 50,000 50,000 won or more so now I'm just gonna go to Subway, grab a sandwich, cause I'm not in the mood to cook. And also I didn't buy groceries, so I'm just going to go and have a sandwich at Subway. If there's one thing I appreciate about being downtown, right now it's the Christmas decorations all around this is so pretty this is so beautiful i love how they have decorated the city so much like the christmas spirit is here you can feel it the christmas spirit is here <laughs> I'm home now. I am just going to. Uh, it's not even unbox. I need a glass of wine. Yo, how, how, how? We do wine here. Inke we do hore. Ke nyore zian. Inke we sang kile zema kaka. Inke we ibulecha sauce no. Inke we ibulecha sauce no. Yo, how wa? Ibuleke tabile le matoke ke chori mezi. Oh my god! Just open up already. Hilang. What the hell is going on? My teeth aren't even that strong. God. What the fuck is this? When did we get here? Why are wines refusing to open? Hi, Nina. Emang 
Ela tá com o hino, né? Sip. Sip. Na 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 que faca. If I like, I can pour the whole thing in here. If I like, but I don't like. Oh, I still have to be drinking this one. So I shall be drinking it at my own pace. You are hearing it? What I bought? All right, so get out of the shoes. This is some cheap wine. Very cheap wine. Let's start with the shoes. I got these um croc looking shoes. They're so cute. Aren't they cute? Cute, right? I'm going to make these my inside shoes for work. Remember, I think it was like two weeks ago. Nah, I don't. But yeah, I bought slippers for my inside shoes at work. So if for those who are watching my vlog for the first time, I should actually work on an intro because there's no way every single week I have a vlog or a video and I'm not even introducing myself to newcomers to, but that's besides the point. But yeah, for those who don't know, in Korea, we have inside shoes and outside shoes. So the shoes that I wear outside are not the shoes that I wear inside. So when I go to work, or like my sneakers or whatever i'll be wearing and then when i get to work i have to change into my work shoes or like my inside shoes not even work shoes my inside shoes so inside shoes is usually like slippers there's not really like a rule as to like what kind of shoes as long as it's comfortable as long as it's not shoes that you're using outside so the shoes the slippers that i have at work right now it's getting colder and colder so i wanted something that has there's some fluffiness to it i mean cute or whatever excuse me daddy one try on haul <laughs> yeah. and then i've got these cute boots oh my god guys i got the black ones nets and takidi wala all along but i needed another pair another one thank you so lemporia had to go abc mud at abc mud they didn't have my size in any of the shoes that i liked i wanted the purple converse they didn't have it um the the, the one that i wanted um yes yeah, 60,000 it's not 60,000 that is a winter shoe and I, I i like it's a big shoe it's a very big shoe ne? and i'm going to be able to wear it in winter with sweatpants so in summer i won't be able to wear that shoe because it's just gonna look ridiculously big on my foot and i'm so grateful to my friend violet for speaking some sense into me because i was going to buy that shoe and it would have looked snacks more in winter it was going to look cute because i'm wearing sweatpants uh puffy items of clothing so it was going to match but in summer if it was just not going to work you know so i was like okay i need another i i wanted to buy three pairs of shoes anyway besides that one that one i'm still thinking about so the purple converse i don't know if i showed you in a clip but the purple converse i wanted to buy that one it didn't have my size i wanted to buy the puma that was 33,000. it didn't have my size i wanted to buy another pair i can't remember what it was but i think it was another puma shoe they didn't have my size so i was like i need shoes i'm not leaving downtown because i'm getting careful because if i keep this money in my account you know what's going to happen this girl right here does not know when to stop swiping for things that she doesn't even need so i was like if i'm going to swipe today i'm going to swipe things that i need so which i'm happy about it's my size and then the last pair of shoes that i bought because i really needed sneakers the boots the cute but i really wanted sneakers so i got this shoe can't remember how much she was so i got this at the underground store underground shopping store where i got the first black boots 
and this was like 44,000. I don't know if that's cheap. This is more actually. This is more than the Puma shoe. Surprise. Because the Puma shoe was 39,000. But I just didn't have a size. So this is like no name. But I needed shoes. Like I needed shoes. There was no way I was leaving downtown. Because I can club. Because first of all, the things on my agenda today was buy groceries and buy shoes. Groceries, it didn't happen because Top Mart was closed. So I'm going to buy groceries tomorrow. Shoes, I needed to buy shoes. So those are the three items of, or the three pairs of shoes that I got. And then, what Daiso? What Daiso make it really laugh, but. Oh, yes! Oh. Finally, I got the cutest stuff ever. Tell me this is not... My children are going to love this. My kids... I saw this from one of my kids. One of my elementary kids came to school with this. Is this not adorable? I will wait. I will wait. Comment down below if you think this is not adorable. Also, comment down below if you think this is adorable. <laughs> Is this not adorable? Is this not cute? Like, like, I am living for the things that I can buy for myself that I would love as a kid. Like, my inner child, happy right now. Cute, pink, fluffy. Guys, like, I'm just the happiest right now. I'm just so happy. Got these. Definitely gonna come in handy as the winter days get colder and colder. And then... I got more earrings, more studs, and some hairpins. I got earrings. You know, from, I think, I can't remember when, but when I last ordered jewelry from Shein, this was the only pair of earrings that I liked from the ones that I had gotten, like, in that entire set. So, I've been wearing these ones. I'm like, oh, I actually love them. So, I got more studded earrings. And then I got a bow. Guys, most of the things that I bought are because I've seen them on my kids. And they look so adorable. My kids are the most adorable children ever. And they always have these adorable accessories in their hair. I'm just like, hmm. I want day. I like day. So, Eriki, in my young one, does does it sit like this? It's like it, it's supposed to like pin my hair back, you know. Like, oh my god! Oh, <gasps> do I not look cute? <gasps> oh my god! I look so adorable. Like, I really like cute things. Oh, do I not look adorable? Do I not look adorable? <laughs> uh, like, if there's one thing that I'm living for right now is making my inner child happy. Honestly. Honestly. Like... Her first, and then I got this cute hair clip. <laughs> I'm obviously not gonna wear this at like um social adult spaces, but I will be wearing this to work because I am a kindergarten teacher. I teach at a preschool, so I know that if I rock up to work like this, my kids are gonna love me even more. Cheers. Here's to the kids right now. Cheers. I am a kindergarten teacher. My children come to school looking like this every day. Different hair colored pins, different bows. Bona. Like, it, like, but cute, shame, but cute. Anyway, on to the next thing. I also got a glass of. Because Violet will be here. I only have like, I don't even have that many wine glasses, you know? So I also got, I have one of this. 
show you champagne glass and then i got another one got another one so violet can also join me for some champagne or some sparkling wine and then i got another wine glass i got another one another wine glass glass of wine i look so cute right now oh my god so yeah I mean, I, I'm, I'm, I'm now ready to have visitors. Oh, oh, one visitor, one visitor, one visitor at a time. So yeah, this is what I went to Daiso for. I walk. Okay, now I'm done with the cute stuff. I'm doing the Daiso unboxing and haul and showing you guys what I got. This I got like these hair accessories and uh, earrings I got from another shop. I don't even want to check my bank account right now. My bank balance sucks to pay for things with your own money but it has to be done but yeah i went to daiso for these the hen glove because who in all hey i almost thought Hohaina, the fifth finger so they don't look cute or whatever but they'll do the job i mean they're warm that's all that matters they are warm excuse me they are warm right and then I got a beanie. I, did, I couldn't find a pink one. It doesn't matter. It's okay. It's okay. As long as it's warm, all right? It has some fluffiness inside, so I'm happy about that. Um, yes, I'm really happy about that. And this pom-pom, this cute pom-pom, anything that looks cute has my name on all over it. So that's what I got. And then I got some skincare because your girl's skin hasn't been improving can you believe it so yeah my skin hasn't improved at all but i can tell you it's in i want because it overwhelmed me but i can keep this one in my hair oh it looks super cute super duper cute so yeah i'm gonna keep this one on But yeah, my skin hasn't been doing well. So I got a cleansing foam. I got like, I got this brand's um, skincare range. I got the cleansing foam, which I'm going to use. And then I got the toner, which I will use after cleansing. And then I got the spot cream because I have like some spots on my cheeks. Oh, who bad, who bad. The, the spot serum, spot cream. And then I got the moisturizer, the moisturizing balm. So cross your fingers with me, please, so that my skin can look somewhat good, you know? Don't I look cute? I love this hair. It's growing on me every day. Like when it first arrived, I was not sure about the color. I was not sure. I was not sure. But now it's like growing on me every single day. So yeah, that's what I got. That's the skincare that I got. And then I got some nail polish remover. Because my nail polish has been getting chipped. And like chipped nail polish is not cute. So I got some nail remover. Nail polish remover. And some press on nails i really like the first press on nails that i got i think they lasted me two weeks and so i was like why not get but i'm only gonna put these on when christmas comes around so that yeah yeah when christmas comes around so yes guys that is all i got at daiso and the shoes that i got like at the underground shopping center and yeah the hair accessories and 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 so i think this is where i'm gonna end the vlog will i take you with me when i go grocery shopping tomorrow i don't know but if not this is where i'll end the vlog so i'll just do the outro right now thank you so much for watching it's always a pleasure having you here
on this side of youtube thank you so much for supporting my channel for liking sharing subscribing i really appreciate it i really appreciate the people who watch my content because coming on youtube i didn't think i i was expecting five views on my videos like i honestly was expecting five views so the fact that my vlogs get like a hundred views that's like a, lo a lot for me personally that is more than i ever expected so i'm very grateful right now actually i'm very grateful thank you yeah i i guess i'm i'm entertaining to some i don't know but i appreciate everyone and i'm almost at 300 subscribers which is quite great so thank you so much thank you to everyone who has been subscribing thank you to everyone who has been liking thank you to everyone who has been sharing thank you to everyone who has been commenting it really means a lot to me um as i said earlier on right now it feels like i'm talking to myself not it feels like right now i am talking to myself but i know when i upload this video i'm not talking to myself i'm talking to someone else who's watching me i'm talking to my subscribers you know so i really do appreciate this it's like it's very therapeutic doing youtube is very therapeutic because it takes me out of my my head as i mentioned earlier on just living by myself spending so much time by myself on a weekend really just does a lot in my head and i'm just like i need a way to not feel like i'm alone all the time hence why i share so much i speak so much i dance so much on my instagram and YouTube is just another, um, it's just another way of me to express myself and not feel like I'm always by myself. I mean, yes, I do communicate with my mom back home, my family back home, my friends back home. But once those calls are over, they're like eight hours behind and I'm eight hours ahead. It's like, I just need something to do that's going to distract me from like overthinking and triggering lymphatic to my anxiety <laughs> so that's why i do youtube honestly and i really appreciate i from the bottom of my heart i really do appreciate everyone who watches my vlogs especially my friend <laughs> shout out to you paula poi finally here's a shout out i hope you're watching this with a glass of wine in your hand there you go that one is for you and shout out to all my other subscribers everyone shout out to all my subscribers actually i hope you're watching this with a glass off shout out see you in my next vlog